Hi friends, uh, today in this video tutorial I will show you how you can download and install one billing software for your uh, retail business. Whatever your retail business, maybe garments, maybe grocery shop, maybe such kind of retail outlet, outlet like uh, spare parts shop, such kind of shop, how you can get one beautiful billing software and simple billing software from Raintech POS uh, billing software. I will show you all the you know steps, step by step. Um, uh, things I will show you how you can download. You can escape from such kind of big, uh, you know, budget uh, software. This is, um, you know, it is very whatever whatever we call like, it is very uh, less uh, price software actually. It is not a big budget software, but you will get all the facilities with all the security. There is a multi, you know, multi user facility. Uh, you know, all the facilities are there. You can see. I will show you how the software will be. Uh, for that, what first of all, what we need to in the below this uh, uh, video uh, description, there is some links you can find out. First link you can see in the video itself. There is a uh, first link. It is available like uh, you know, install Crystal Report. You can uh, click on this link or you can copy that link to Google uh, and you can download this uh, you know uh, Crystal Report. This is the foundation for the software basically. Um, without a crystal report, you know, you will not get such kind of reports and all. So, first you install a crystal report. It is a 70 MB file, it is not a big file, uh, and it is very safe also. It is Microsoft Crystal Report. Uh, you can download that one and you can install it. Second one, what we need to install the barcode, barcode font, you need to install this uh, barcode font I highlighted here also. This link also you have to download. And you have to install it. And in, in, first of all, you save to your desktop or somewhere, then you can install it, it will be very you know safe. And the third one, uh, you need to install the you know uh, the link the sorry the um, billing software. There is a billing software link you can see the third link. Uh, uh, Raintech uh, Middle East billing software third link you can find out, you can download that one also, you can install it. And if in the case your computer is Windows 7, you need to install .NET Framework also, that in, that link also I have given below, uh, so that you can install that one. And the activation key also I given here in the description itself, uh, to activate the software, there is a key required, activation key, that also I have given in the description, you can uh, see that one. I have downloaded all the things, I will show you one by one how it looks like, um, it will look like this, see. Uh, all the things I have downloaded here already. So first one, this one crystal report, you can click like that. It is already installed in my PC, that's why it is uh, asking whether we need to reinstall or not. You, if it is not installed, you, can, you have to click next, next, next and finish it. Very simple way you can install it. There is no much uh, complication uh, in the you know crystal report. It is very smoothly it will install. And the barcode font also you can op click like that and install in the top button. Yes, like that you can install it, it is very uh, user friendly actually. And uh, the third one is the Raintech POS billing software here, uh, this one I, I am clicking that one. I am installing, next, next, very simple, you know, three, four steps are there. In that three, four st uh, step, you, you will get a beautiful uh, billing software. In this billing software, there is even the VAT facility also is there, non VAT facility also is there, both options are there in this uh, software. And here you can see in the right, uh, the desktop, there is icon already created after installation. Uh, you can click, double click on that icon. If the software is not activated, it will activate, it will ask for, you know, activation key. Activation key I already given in the description bef before. In the description you can uh, see the activation key also here. Uh, the same activation key you can uh, put it in your software and you can install it. Here I am putting uh, admin, A-D-M-I-N. Admin, whether uh, small letter or uh, capital letter, no problem. Uh, or uh, one, two, three, four, five, I am putting here actually. Uh, here, see the beautiful uh, billing software already installed, Raintech POS billing software already installed. And here, the next thing is that we need to add uh, you know uh, products to our software, you know, uh, add our uh, products. Whatever the products is there, we need to add the products to our uh, billing software. Uh, in order to that, there is options are there, this, here uh, you can add products here. Uh, before that I will show you one small thing also, there here one uh, master under you can see. Company info, your company all information you can save here. 
uh, you can put in which state you are saudi arabia kuwait bahrain dubai abu dhabi like that you can add it here city also you can add your your email id or your currency uh, kuwait dinar kwd uh, kwd kuwait dinar or whatever it is you can add it over there and update so that your uh, currency already add over there and uh, uh, here i am going there to add one product here uh, i will add uh, for example t-shirt t-shirt any product mobile phone t-shirt whatever the products you have you can add it and you will put one uh, code also and uh, here you can put for example uh, 300 uh, you per 200 your purchase rate and you are selling on 300 kuwait dinar for example kuwait dinar any currency you can uh, use in middle east or saudi arabia or say said you here I can make a minimum stock maintenance. For example, in the minimum stock, it will give the software uh, software will give the alert that this product is going to finish like that. Opening stock, I am putting 50 pieces. This uh, 50 pieces uh, came to me and uh, that, for example, 5 percentage VAT is there uh, and I am putting that. And uh, in the unit, I am putting pieces, pieces and uh, save or barcode will come automatically in case any product have a barcode you can uh, de remove this uh, automatic generated barcode number and you can put your uh, barcode number there is no problem and uh, just uh, save it save it close it so immediately you will see the right side there is a stock button is there click on that stock in report immediately you can see the stock current stock see T-shirt is how many pieces is there? There is uh, 50 pieces T-shirt is there. You can see immediately stock report. And there is a barcode. Any product is, uh, you want to generate barcode, it is piece of cake actually. Click on barcode button and uh, see there is uh, generate barcode one. Click on that, immediately you will get a barcode. See, I zoom it. It is 2 inch by 1 inch barcode. It is small size actually. It is uh, 2 inch by 1 inch barcode actually and uh, close it please and uh, now we will see how we can do the sale before the sale uh, we need to add the printer here in the master entry uh, any printer is already added over there you can just de uh, delete it and add your printer i am pu uh, putting this uh, uh, pdf printer so that i can show you the preview save sorry before uh, saving i want to update uh, thermal it be, it because it is 3 inch printer, that's why I am putting thermal printer. Uh, update. Successfully update. Now I am going to uh, POS sale. Uh, select that product uh, t-shirt. Uh, add to cart. Settle. Here see the right side, you can see many options are there. You can print the bills on Arabic format, English format, A4 format. There is a multiple options are there. I am putting this Arabic format because normally in uh, Arabic it will come. So, for example, 500 Kuwait dinar, 500 Kuwait dinar is not there, no, 200, 20 rupees, 20 uh, Kuwait dinar, 20 Kuwait dinar. For example, 300 Kuwait dinar I put here. And I am, and I am saving and printing. Save and print. Save and print immediately there is a printout will come if the printer is connected. Here I am not connected to the printer, that's why I am uh, making it in uh, VDF. Uh, format see I make it in PDF automatically because it is PDF I make it as a default printer that's the reason see the beautiful billing format will come this will come in 3 inch printer that is a 3 inch thermal printer is there in that printout we can uh, make the output see this is the Arabic and English both mix is there uh, any uh, everybody can understand if some foreigners also is coming to this Arabic uh, Kuwait they can understand. That's the reason we have put both uh, language. See the Arabic language and the uh, English language both we have added there. And it is very simple. See the um, KWD what we put it in our uh, home screen that also came here. Any currency you are putting uh, that will automatically will, leak, will, uh, will come in this uh, software. In this way we can simply install this software. And uh, there is you know current stock. See one piece we have sold out. 50 pieces was there. Now it is 49 actually. See, you can see here 49 pieces only. This is the one, 49 pieces only right now, current uh, stock. You can see here. Uh, this is a very, very simple way you can uh, manage your, uh, you know, billings. And uh, there is another option is called Excel import export bulk uh, option is there. 
Uh, here you can see the import export products. Uh, here you can upload your all entire product through Excel sheet. One Excel sheet, export to product first of all. Uh, then you can fill all your you know products and import it. So all your product will come to the software in very such a you know quickly. See this format, it will come already. You can just fill your products name here and uh, you know purchase rate, sales rate, discount in case you have VAT or such things is there. You can just uh, you know you can upload all your products through Excel sheet also. It is quite simple actually. Uh, so this is when I am closing. And um, there is a, another option is also is called a POS credit in case you are selling uh, to customers on credit uh, option. There is uh, you know credit options also is there and there is you know uh, sales returns option is there if some you, if you sell some product there is a sales return you want to take that option is there. Quotation option is there if you want to create some quotation for customers that option also is there. And uh, you know, purchase and if you are purchasing the product from another customer or sorry, another supplier, that option also is there in the software. And um, uh, purchase return, if for example, some products you purchase and you want to return it back, it is not good, the quality is not good. Uh, that all details you will get, and the sales report you will get over here. Very simple, actually, all of the reports. See, this report also you will get a sales report per day, daily, what sales you have done, and that report you will get which day what how much VAT is there or not any quick report and if uh, you want to VAT detailed report in the records VAT report sales all the reports you will get in the date wise uh, in the you can put your date over there you can put you know date wise report also uh, in the VAT report so this is a very beautiful and very simple and easiest software any doubt is there, any installation doubt is there, any, any suppose for example handling doubt is there, you can call us, our number is 8078311945 and you have to add a country code also, plus 9180781945, this is our contact number, our email address also is there in the software itself, reindexstore at gmail.com, you can contact us, you can call us, you can whatsapp us, please, uh, we are ready to help you for all your, you know, queries and uh, uh, doubts and all. So, this is the very easiest way we can uh, handle your uh, bills and inventory system uh, for your retail business. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you. Bye-bye.